In this 12 on Health report, Brooklyn inventors are at it again. Their ideas are getting more and more unique. This time, it's a trendy-looking scarf that filters germs and pollution at the same time. News 12's Dana Arshin got to test out the scarves for herself. She brings us this story from Gowanus. Why are we so impolite? Why do we feel like it's okay to cough on everyone on the subway? Instead of waiting around for the answers, Andrew Kessler and his business partners decided to invent the scoff. It's a combination of the words scarf and cough. Scoff. It is a scarf that has a hidden pocket in it that we can put a face mask in. That face mask is made with a carbon filter and silver. The active carbon absorbs all of those funky germs and pollution, and when you impregnate it with silver, the silver actually kills the viruses. So here is how it works. First, you find the center part. This is the pouch area that you put the face mask in, and then you can either choose to put the ear straps on, and just like a regular scarf, you wrap and you pull. This is how it's done. Alexa Nigro, one of the co-founders, sews each scarf in this Gowanus apartment. The scarves are mostly made of cotton, and some are blended with cashmere and wool. They cost anywhere from 39 to 59 bucks each. In other countries where there's more smog and pollution, it's a great way to just, like, look good while protecting yourself and stay warm. We think that if everyone wore a scarf, then, oh, you could reduce the costs of your health care and, and all these other big worldly benefits. And some doctors agree. Dr. Murad Shahabar, a Brooklynite who likes to support local businesses, tells us it may be beneficial against airborne pathogens like the flu or the common cold, and it may also help shield the exhaust that comes from vehicles here in New York City. So whether it's for health or high fashion, the inventors hope customers will wrap their heads around the idea of the scoff. Reporting from Gowanus, Dana Arshin, News 12. Brooklyn. More information on the scoff, head over to news12.com, click on numbers and links.